I read a news article from earlier this month, May, that a tentative deal settlement has been reached in the lawsuit against Kona Brewing Company. Well, technically their parent company, Craft Brewers Alliance. I did videos on this previously where the two ladies from California are suing them because they said that the artwork was deceptive and it made them think that the beer really came from Hawaii. If the ladies could read, which they apparently can't, the side of the bottle clearly says where it's brewed, at least locations, uh, which is Portland, Oregon, Woodville, Washington, or at least used to be, St. Louis, Missouri, Portsmouth, New Hampshire, but these ladies can't read. Even more surprising was shortly after that, a judge allowed it to go forward because she felt, yeah, it is a little deceptive. So not only do we have two ladies that were unable to read, but also looking for a fast buck, because let's face it, that's what they're looking for. They just want an easy buck. The judge clearly does not have the competence to know it's a bullshit lawsuit. So I was following this periodically, and I searched for it a few days ago, and I saw where Craft Brewers Alliance is going to spend about $4.7 to sell the lawsuit. I'm sure a good chunk of that's going to pay the lawyers. I'm sure the two ladies that, have, that are unable to read, and maybe other people who joined the lawsuit, I never said, read if there were more than two people. Uh, I'm sure some of it's going to go to them, but I would not be surprised if the majority of the money goes to the lawyers. So we have ambulance chasing attorneys here who want a quick buck, and two ladies who I have no problem saying they clearly are incompetent. Well, no, 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 they're not incompetent. They want easy money. They seem so happy. You know, I mean, uh, one excellent comment I read a couple of years ago is that why don't you sue Keebler cookies because their cookies are not made in trees by elves? Yeah. Tell you the tiger isn't real. Sue them over that. Uh, neither is Toucan Sam, they're cartoon characters, sue them too. The ladies just want easy money. Well, so Craft Brewers spokesperson, I forget who, said that they're settling the lawsuit because it's basically keeping them from their business operations and it's just cheaper to sell the lawsuit to keep fighting it. I'm sure when the ladies filed the lawsuit that they figured this would happen. I honestly thought it would get tossed. About a year ago, I was at the Wigmer Brewery talking to the manager there. Uh, they have a, they have a couple of them, but the the taproom manager, nice guy. And I brought this up, and he goes, "Oh my God, I know, I know." And I said, "What do you think's going to happen?" He said, "I think it's going to get thrown out." We we're both wrong. And I told him, "You, this is such a bullshit lawsuit. The ladies obviously just want easy money." And he said, "Yeah, they do." He even said before I could say anything. If you read the side of the bottle, it tells you where it's brewed. And there were comments on the original lawsuit, people saying these ladies just want a fast buck. Yeah, they do. So, I guess you sue happy ladies, you got what you wanted. The lawsuit, uh, you basically won because craft brewers, I think what they're really doing is saying, you know what, you're not worth our time, we'll just go ahead and pay you. And, uh, you know move on with life. But a comment to the ladies in California who started the lawsuit and the other anybody else who may have joined it, it's people like you that make this miserable, that make it hard for brewers because they're just trying to produce a beer and you know make some, make a little money and give us a product we like. It's people like you that make it make life miserable because all you do is you want free easy money. I wouldn't be a bit surprised if both you ladies are just low lives, sue happy or gossiping or make problems for other people at work or elsewhere. It's probably not your first major complaint trying to get free stuff. That's the kind of people you are. Well, you know what? You sued, you basically won, and uh, I wish they would keep fighting it, but honestly I could see why Woodmer CBA dropped it. It was it's a lot of money. Now four million dollars probably isn't a ton to them. That's very little. But still, you know, 
you ladies are just unbelievable pieces of work. And uh, you're pathetic. Frankly, you're very pathetic. I doubt this is the first time you've sued somebody or made life hell for somebody else. And probably not your last. So, uh, I don't really have anything more to say on this one here. Really surprised they settled it, though. I, I figured they'd, the CBA would fight, but I get their position. Well, that's in the lawsuit, so, uh, yeah, I, I guess that's all, and uh, we just all move on, and the ladies get rich over being complete bitches. Well, not rich, but they get money just over bullshit lawsuits.